In the arena where the ground is is um level level yeah it would sure make a big difference for her but she's a nice mare i mean she has no vices at all whatsoever i do think that um the way she shod is not good um i could actually see the way she shod being part of the hill pain problem um Generally, if you have a horse with heel pain, you want to kind of broaden the shoes a little bit and give them some heel support. And she's really kind of got her heels wrapped in tight in these shoes. And I personally think that you can go from being a three and a half to probably a one and a half lameness wise in her front feet just by correcting the way she shod. Also, the mare's been here for two weeks with no Equiox or Butte. She's had nothing. So I think that you could take this probably even with Butte and a better shoe job from a three and a half to a, a, a one minimum. I mean, I think we could probably get her a hundred percent down. Like right there in the crossover, you can tell she can get a little short. So. Personally, I think that we can get her sound. I don't, she doesn't bother me. Um, but like they said, they gave 15,000 for her. That's a lot of money. That's a really nice lesson horse. And if you're looking for a horse that's just for you and you're not gonna be trying to ride it five or six days out of the week, and you're not gonna be riding two to three lessons a day, she would be perfect for you and she would be suitable for any rider, advanced, intermediate, beginner, child that's never had a horse before she is a big mare and she had been used um in hunters so she's a big tall english horse but she rides around western beautiful so i think you would be just as pleased with her as a western horse as you would an english horse they said she does jump but she cannot take the jumping anymore that her, her feet stay really sore jumping so i stand behind her a hundred percent i just her feet are what they are so if you're interested in her, just inbox me. I mean, she's sure broke enough. She actually do. Like, you can tell she's actually been shown. I bet she's been shown in some trail classes, too, because she's... What'd you say? She 4-H. Yeah. I think that she sure, if you look right here, she's got a big hunk of foot. This all cracking off. I sure think that she could be improved just by being shod differently. So, but I have a farrier that specializes in this kind of stuff. And I know that he could take her, you know, she's probably at a three right now. Like 
on a scale of one to five, she's probably a two and a half or a three. And I think with some with some maintenance, like Equiox, we could probably take her down pretty easy and get her to one and a half. And then with better shoes, I bet we could get her 100% sound. So if you're interested in her, inbox me. Um, I can have my farrier go ahead and get on top of this. And she's a good one. She's a really good one. We'll get good photos of her. This is Abby.